Hey guys, what's happening? Uh, so today I want to do a quick review on the combo that I used for the majority of 2019. Uh, purchased it back early spring as my first bait caster. Uh, well, I'm getting back into fishing and I haven't looked back. I absolutely love it. Um, it's great for us budget fishermen who who want to get back into bass fishing or just now start to get into fishing, but don't quite have the bank account to uh, bankroll the big high dollar gear that you know that all of our favorite fishermen use. So today I'm going to talk about the uh, Abu Garcia Black Max combo. Um, this is a fantastic starter combo. Uh, I think you could pick this up at at your Walmart for like sixty to seventy bucks. Uh, the price point on it's fantastic for for entry level level guys. Um, and even, even for experienced fishermen, I don't see anything wrong with this bait caster. Uh, the rod is, it's a 6.6 medium rod. Uh, the sensitivity on the tip is great. It's a, it's a fantastic all around, all around rod and reel. Even if I didn't care for the reel itself, uh, this, this rod got to pay for itself. If you're a pond hopper and you don't want to take all of your gear with you to the pond. This is a fantastic, just all around combo that works great for just about anything that you're throwing. There's not really too much to talk about with this rod. Uh, it, it, like I said, it's great. It's sturdy. I haven't had any problems. The eyelets haven't given me any kind of problems this year. Uh, I've done quite a, quite, quite a good torture test on it. Uh, between me and my three-year-old, we We've, we've beat this thing up pretty good. So in and out of the truck, you know, banging the tip on stuff, uh, him just kind of beating it around um, and haven't had any issues, not one whatsoever. Uh, this is, I said, the Abu Garcia Black Max. I think you can pick just the reel up for 30, 40 bucks, something like that, which again is a fantastic price point. Got a 6-4-1 gear ratio with five ball bearings. It's very simple and user friendly. Uh, as far as tuning it goes, you've got, you know, your minimum and maximum break. I like to keep it on the couple clicks off minimum. Uh, you got your tensor knob over here, like every other bait caster has, and you know, of course, your drag. But it's very well built. It's super lightweight. Um, I don't really have too many complaints about it. There are a few few times I'll get a hiccup in it but I think that's kind of just me having wrong settings on it. It's a great beginner's bait caster. You don't break the bank. You don't have to go spend $200 on a reel. And this is something that you can get into and build your confidence up before you go and purchase a higher end, higher end bait caster. And, you know, instead of testing the water and ready to throw that in the pond, you can just, you know, kind of give this a shot and see how you like it. The weight on this thing is fantastic. I think it's like seven, seven ounces maybe can't remember uh but it's all plastic which a lot of people shy away from but in this case you know it hasn't caused me any any issues whatsoever uh when i first bought this i kind of asked myself you know if i go pay 60 70 dollars for this combo is it going to last me or am i going to have to buy three or four of them in a year you know which then doesn't make any sense to go with the budget but this is like i said has had some this has had a very good torture test done on it. I caught my personal best bass on it this year. Uh, really gave it a good work over. It does work best, I found out, when you keep the spool filled. Uh, if you're running run anywhere half half a spool or lighter, it just it's not that the the reel itself doesn't work, but you lose a lot of your castability. And I'll get into that here shortly. As far as this is compared to your higher dollar reels, yes, you're gonna get farther casts. It's gonna be smoother. You know, you're gonna have better retrieves. Uh, with the six, six, four, one ratio on it, you don't get a lot, there's not a lot of speed. So you're gonna do some extra, extra cranking. And if you've got that big fish on, you're gonna really want that, the extra, gears to get them to your the bank or the boat quicker but but for a, a pond hopper or a beginner this is still fantastic uh, as far as casting goes the casting ability is incredible i've i've had some of my longest casts on this 
you do, I have noticed that you do need to thumb the spool quite a bit. And, and that's something that comes over practice and just how you tune. I mean, you've got to practice everything in order to, to become comfortable with it. But I've really whipped this thing and backlash has been minimal. I mean, at the beginning, you know, like every, every rookie in the bait casters, you, backlash the bird's nest is a part of the game. You just kind of got used to it. But the more I practiced and the more comfortable I got with it, I noticed that, you know, you can really whip this thing out there and put it right up there with some of your higher dollar reels. The short cast, um, I haven't had any problems, you know, flipping, pitching, you know, your shorter, your shorter, you know, cast, just trying to get in, in there underneath some brush or whatever you're doing. I haven't had any problems. Uh, this has just been an all around great reel, smooth retrieve with very few, if any hiccups in it, you know, but uh, I would highly recommend this. This is the Abu Garcia Black Max. You can pick it up at your Walmart. The combo is $60, $70. And that was about a year ago. So by now, you know, the Abu's probably came out with something else. So you might be able to find this $40, $50, you know, cheaper on Amazon or find some used guys who are trying to upgrade. As far as this goes, I, I have no, I will continue to use this. I, I may even go buy a couple more. Um, that's it, guys. Uh, thanks for watching. Um, if you enjoy content like this and want to see some more out of, out of our channel like this, uh, hit the subscribe button, smash the like button. Hit the bell so you get notified if we uh, post up new videos. And thanks for watching, guys. See you next time.